Sometimes I will lighten the mood by saying that, hey, don't worry, I've seen many of things. So just tell me what happened to you. I won't be surprised. And to let them know that I won't uh, be shocked when they tell me any about their medical history. Uh, I think it is also important for us to stay calm uh, to whatever they are going to tell us. Uh, for example, if they uh, tell me about their HIV infection or uh, hepatitis C infection, uh, I will reply to them, oh, I see, so uh, how did you find that out? And so to uh, guide them to tell me more about how they uh, go to seek for treatment uh, instead of uh, letting them feel that I'm very shocked about this uh, status. Dr. Barringham is a passionate person and one of the best psychologists in Hong Kong. We all know he always takes the initiative to offer support to his clients or even those he doesn't know at all. His willingness to take prompt action for anyone who needs immediate advice plus his friendliness to anyone he comes across has made him um, the best reliable co-worker, among others, to us and to other case workers. And then I would, I would draw on narrative therapy techniques to help them to see what I see outside, I mean, what I see them outside of HIV context, so the potentials, um, uh, what kind of person they, uh, they were before having HIV, and then they would be able to see a new identity outside of being an, an so-called HIV patient. Most healthcare providers, they did not uh, want to uh, decline the service offer to the patient. However, they may not have enough uh, knowledge uh, and also their staffs may not be confident enough to provide a healthcare service to the people living with HIV. Therefore, I suggest that they should uh, seek the, some training related to uh, HIV patients so that they can understand nowadays actually the people living with HIV, they are having a very good health and they does not need any other special attention usually.